The Barista League is back. A remote coffee competition for baristas by baristas. Each week, five competitors battle it out in nine unique coffee challenges to win the massive grand prize, a five-day trip to the world-renowned Deterra Coffee Farm in Brazil, where they will pick and process their very own coffees alongside other world champions. Here's to celebrating coffee, learning something new, and staying connected right here on the Barista League Online Season 2. of the Barista League Online Season 2. And this season, we're bigger, better, and even more baristier than ever. Back in August, we opened applications to hopeful baristas from around the world to find out the most creative way they can brew a cup of coffee. Let's check it out. Sometimes, we don't have the time to make ourselves a good cup of coffee at home. Thanks for watching, and I hope to be considered for season two of the Brewster League Online. Coffee is a place where we can come together, and that's why I want to be a part of this challenge. Oh, I hope you consider my application, and I hope to see you guys soon. Thanks for watching, um, and happy brewing! Hmm, coffee brewed in the shower. I'm picking up notes of suave, summer breeze. And now the time has come to introduce our season two finalists. They are all waiting for my call to find out if they have made the final cut. Can you hear me? Sorry, I'm out in the middle of New York, so it's like crazy. Hi, Emily. Yes, I can hear you. Congratulations. You have made it into the Barista League Online season two. <laughs> that makes me so happy, genuinely. Hi, my name is Emily Bryant. I am a barista and coffee educator from Houston, Texas, but I live currently in New York City. I've been a barista for, oh my goodness, five years now. And I remember I had to get a part-time job. I did not want to do it. As soon as I started working, I immediately got bit by the coffee bug. Then I haven't looked back. Now that I'm here and, you know, making coffee and it's become my career and I've met so many amazing people, I just, I know I'm never gonna go back. Welcome, Emily. I can't wait to see what she has in store for us this season. Okay, I have three different baristas in three different time zones to call. There's Paula in California, LaCrista in North Carolina, and Ken, who's all the way in Japan. This is so exciting. Hi, guys. Congratulations. You've all made it into the Barista League Online Season 2. Okay, that just made my day. Now I can sleep well. Yes. Hi, I'm Ken from Sydney, Australia. I'm a barista and working at Tokyo. And I'm a total coffee addicted person. There's no like right or wrong in coffee. It's never ending. It's just exploring stuff. It's, it's total adventure. One of my dreams is being as a buyer. I want to especially focus on Asian country coffee farm. I think they have really strong potential about coffees and I think it's getting better and better. People they always ask, are you Australian or are you Japanese? I'm Ken, so just just look at me. I have this samurai spirit. I have the koala spirit. If you fusion that, it's totally unique. Krista MacArthur here. I'm from North Carolina, born and raised. I wasn't allowed to drink coffee. My mom was very strict on that's like a rite of passage. You know, it's when you become an adult, that's when you drink coffee. I was either 15 or 16 back in high school and my family knew that I was obsessed with grants. So they made sure that I was able to go on the high school trip. While we were there, 
I went to the shop. They were like, come back behind the bar and let me make drinks. And in a shop in Paris, learning how to use some really cool, super expensive, probably could hurt me if I used it wrong, espresso machine. My current passion project is the Barista Coalition. The whole goal behind the Barista Coalition was to take a step aside from competition and education and kind of create an area where it's more of a sense of family. You know, you walk in and you kind of just instantly connect with the people behind the bar. I wanted to create an area within the coffee community where that was just the sole focus. And I'm going to win the Barista League online because I am confident I am creative with coffee and the universe is on my side. Hola amigos from the Barista League, my name is Paola Chaparro. I was born and raised in Puebla, Mexico, and then I moved to California 10 years ago. I currently work at Go Get Em Tiger. I roasted for over a year, and then I stopped roasting and I went back to Barista. I just realized that I wasn't meant to be by myself in a room. I was really lonely, so I decided to go back to my roots and make coffee and make latte and have fun, you know? Friends will describe me as a caffeinated magical unicorn. This season of the Barista Selling Online, you can expect from me a lot of creativity, a lot of jokes, that you're gonna be waiting for it and like, what is she gonna do now? I just know that Ken, LaCrista, and Paola are going to absolutely kill it this season. We want to take a quick moment to thank our wonderful video partner. The Barista League Online is proudly brought to you by Pacific Foods Barista Series. This season, our competitors are exclusively using Barista Series oat and hemp products for all their non-dairy needs. Barista Series Oat is the result of hundreds of hours of tasting, testing, steaming and pouring so that it can be everything you need it to be. It pairs effortlessly with coffee and performs remarkably in espresso. Barista Series Oat is available now. Head to pacificfoodservice.com or at Barista Series on Instagram for more information. So I guess this means we're down to our final competitor. And the fifth. And final barista is... Woo I'm so excited, oh my gosh. My name is Miranda Haney and I'm a barista and marketing coordinator at Greater Goods Coffee in Austin, Texas. I moved here a year ago from Baltimore not knowing anybody. Pretty much I just moved because I read some best cities to live in America. Clickbait. Austin loves baby baristas. I can't stress that enough. Competed in my first U.S. Barista Championship and I got all the way to nationals. That is something I could not have done without the help of the Austin coffee community. They're amazing. I'm gonna win the Barista League because I'm creative, I am competitive, I am fun to watch on camera, and I'm not afraid to be ridiculous. We've met our five baristas and they are amazing. Comment and let us know who you're rooting for. Make sure you like, subscribe, and turn on notifications because next week on the Barista League Online Season 2, it's the DIY Roast Challenge where each competitor will make a homemade roaster that's good enough to impress an industry legend. Trust me, you're not going to want to miss this. See you then. Peace.